Hey guys, we're Baron 20 back again with the most extreme story I've ever seen in my entire life. Gary Bowser, he's a well-known hacker. He's been in prison. He got sentenced to prison for 40 months and he just was charged with $10 million that he owes. He has to pay back Nintendo. He's getting released out of prison currently right now within the next week or so. He's getting released for good behavior, uh, but he still owes Nintendo over $10 million. Now, what makes this story crazy is in court, he agreed um, to just, you know, he's never going to be able to pay back Nintendo $10 million. Nintendo knows this. It's, it's somebody like, imagine if somebody like me or you um, had to pay someone $10 million. It, it doesn't matter what job you got. You're not going to be able to pay it back. That's a lot of money. Um, and Nintendo knows this. So they came to an agreement where this man has to pay Nintendo 30% of his salary, no matter where he works for the rest of his life or until the $10 million is paid in full, which means he's basically going to be giving Nintendo 30% of his pay for the rest of his life because he's never going to pay back um, that money. Um, what makes this story even crazier, it goes even bigger than that, is he was in prison. And if you guys know, when you're in prison, sometimes there's some work you can do in prison um, to keep yourself occupied. They'll give you some odd jobs to do, and they pay you for it, right? It's almost like, you know, you work in the kitchen or whatever you do. And um, it's very, you know, it's notorious for very low-paying jobs in prison, right? Because you're, you're in prison. Um, Nintendo already put, you know, that into action. They already started taking 30% of his money even with him barely making pennies in prison. Put it this way, they took $25 a month from this man in prison, which equaled up to about $175. So $175 of his debt has already been paid um, while he was in prison. Um, I, I think it's wild that Nintendo already put it into action. They were like, nah, -uh, buddy, you owe us 30% of your pay for life. Unreal, man, like... Could you, could you imagine paying 30% of your salary for life? We're not talking NWO, man. We're talking like 30% of your salary, man. I, <laughs> I just, that's crazy. I, I feel like it's a little too much. I feel like Nintendo like overstepped their, I mean, they're really, really trying to, you know, set a precedence here. They're really trying to make uh, anyone else who is thinking about, you know, pirating games or you know making money off of nintendo's uh you know ips uh you better you better think twice they're coming for your soul 30 percent of your pay for the rest of your life i'm making this video to bring awareness i don't know if you knew about this i just found out i thought it was crazy i couldn't stop reading it i'll leave a link below so you can read the article for yourself guys do me a favor go ahead and leave a comment let me know do you think this was did the punishment fit the crime? Like, did they overstep their boundaries? I feel like that's a, I mean, I feel like that's crazy. 30% of your pay for the rest of your life, man. That's going to really screw him forever. I mean, granted, he committed a crime, but does this punishment fit the crime? I'm going to let you guys figure that out and let me know what you think in the comments below. Pretty much all for right now, guys. And as always, there'll be more to come shortly. Thanks again.